There's an unlimited loot spot in Horizon Zero Dawn and I will show you where and when you can do this in the story. So let me know what you think in the comments down below and don't forget to hit that like button. So all the credits go to Wizard Kelly, I put a link to his Twitter down in the description below. He sent me this very interesting way to get unlimited shards in Horizon Zero Dawn and we both tried it in the New Game Plus mode on Ultra Hard. The only catch is that you have to be at the heart of the Nora quest later on in the game. Of course, if you replay the New Game Plus mode, you can just stop there, get some nice shards before continuing with the story. Of course, really great if you're playing on the Ultra Hard mode since Farming is not really an option anymore, the machines have way more health, cost way more resources to kill and the price in the shops have increased. So like I said, this unlimited farm spot is part of a quest, so now we'll follow spoilers for the heart of the Nora quest. You still here? Okay, in the quest, mother's hearts get attacked by a corrupted thunder jaw that you have to try and kill. After you've done that, don't continue just yet, instead go outside of mother's heart near the campfire. There's a corruptor there and other dead machines and bodies. If you save at the campfire, then hit reload loss save game, you can actually loot all those corpses again. You got two corruptors, some scrappers, some other machines, bodies, and then you can just go back to the campfire, reload your lost save, still have the shards that you just picked up, and then you can just do it again and again until you think you got enough. Cool is that while doing this mission, you can still go back to the shop, sell the stuff, like for example the blue and the green mods that you then get, and then go back to do it over again and still have room for new mods. Per time you do this, something that takes less than one minute, you can get around the 200 shards and also the modifications, the corruptor hearts, desert glasses, slack shine glasses, and more things that you can then sell for around the 20, 25 each or even more in terms of the uh, Corruptor Heart that is 75 and the Corruptor Lenses are 38. So if you add that all together it's like 230 or maybe even 300 shards per minute doing this in the Ultra Hard mode. Okay compared to killing Rock Breakers in Easy mode this is not really that much because of course killing the Rock Breakers will also get you purple mods and stuff like that. But here you don't really have to fight or waste any resources, you just get a lot of stuff for just looting people. And of course if you are playing on the ultra hard mode you can't farm like the rock breakers as easily as on the easy mode obviously. Like I already mentioned you can just go and explore the rest of the world like get all the lodge weapons, do all the cauldrons, bandit camps and then if you need some shards go back to this main story mission, do all the looting again and again. Of course, eventually you want to continue the main story mission, but you can also do the side quest. I mean, really in New Game Plus mode, there's really no hurry to finish the game. Unless you care about the date that is like under your trophies and want to face paint as soon as possible. I just mean in terms of main story, of course, your first play to you just want to see the whole story. Right now you already know what's going to happen. So doing the side missions first to get the lodge weapons, for example, can also be a thing. So just something interesting I want to share, of course, thanks to Wizard Kelly again. Put his Twitter in the description down below. I'm not going to deny that I have not done some sweet loot runs this way for that sweet money. Not that much though. <laughs> Chances are high that Gurla Games will look into this now and maybe fix it. So if you want to use it, you might want to act fast. Let me know if you're going to do this and what you think in the comments down below. Subscribe for everything on Rise Zero Dawn. Of course, don't forget to hit the like button and thanks a lot for watching. Goodbye.